in what looks like a finishing touch to the preparation of the Akwa Ibom's People's Democratic Party for the 2015 <laughs> governorship poll. Supporters of the party gathered at the National Theatre in Lagos to show off support with the PDP governorship candidate for Akwa Ibom State, Udom Emmanuel. The outgoing Akwa Ibom governor stepped forward to present to the people the man he thinks is capable of leading the people of Akwa Ibom in what he calls a continuity project. I have picked the right products, the correct products, and I'm taking it to the market at the correct time. And that is why Udom is correct. In a quick sequence, Emmanuel Udom steps to the podium to assure the people of his capabilities. I want to assure you that at this next level of sustainable development, we'll start with human capacity. We've looked at a foundation that's been led with free and compulsory education at that basic level. How do we take it off from there? We'll start looking into how do we enhance on quality. I keep saying so. You cannot build something and go to sleep. Competition will take you out. Today, if you look at Samsung, Sony, and the rest of them were superpowers on electronics. Samsung woke up overnight. They wanted to exert the whole world. They brought out a curved TV. Excellent technology through research and innovations. We are going to say that at the next phase, we'll look at how do we enhance quality. We'll try as much as practicable to make sure that Teachers, even right from primary school, are well trained and well exposed. It turns out to be a PDP family affair, as the PDP governorship candidate in Lagos State, Mr. Jimmy Agbaje, makes an appearance. Governor Agbaje welcomes him, and Mr. Agbaje grabs the opportunity to make his political pitch. South South is mobilized for the president in Lagos. <laughs> that Come February 14th, the South South is going to vote 100% for President Goodluck-Jola. And come February 28th, they are going to vote 100% for Jimmy Agbaje. The event ends in a lively mood. Perhaps the promises from Emmanuel Udom's manifesto has given the people here a reason to cheer.